the shrine helps a lot. You need to like not get five priorities on the scarf, and uh, his nukes actually aren't that big a deal anymore anyway. Yeah, this is a fun Centaur's gonna have getting boxed from level one. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, I kind of expect him to really live through low. this. Maybe he won't. Yeah, he won't. Oh, he doesn't <laughs> solve the auto attack. I guess I'm wrong. He yeah, let there it go. A second following. So. He also missed the lane warp, I bet. And some of their other lanes. Yeah, the Tinker definitely has to be slightly more careful. Oh, here we go, mid lane. Showing, but... Got a little bit of stampede and a stomp. Oh, no, Waiting for the TP that. before Astro. Uh, I don't know. Probably wouldn't have saved him, but at least maybe they would have made the follow-up a little bit easier, but they might just find one anyway. There's a grave. There's a dunk. Well, that's, uh, you know, axe dazzle, guys. We, yes, we've seen that one before. Well. Yeah, it's like... Young Mind's timing was kind of when Centaur hit six, oh, and Carol. they tried to smoke, but now this axe timing is just... It trumps it, you know? Oh, they that, had that like range, this. though. Yeah. That was like the Dwight Howard dunk right there. The the max reach. He needs like more time to get online. You know, he's looking more around the 25 minute mark as opposed to the 15. Which at that point, they could have already lost all their tier 2s if uh, Tinker gets picked off. Unfortunate amount of times. The way to prevent that is like doing what they're doing now, where they're smoking the centaur up. But I'm not sure the silencer is the kill they want. It's going to be the one they, they get, though. They might even not get it, because the centaur's in fucking no man's land. Oh, yeah, they don't stampede, but there's our swap. Stop back. Morphling could come through as well. Oh, oh he's not going to come in, though. All right. He missed a double dunk. Oh. Yeah, it's unacceptable. He needs to run on yourself. But he's firing a salve out. He's a cold player now. He's just using the courier speed for his to ferry a salve out. <laughs> oh, it feels good, man. <laughs> Oh, it's the global silence and the jumping on the axe. This is, uh, what you expect. I and there's just this oh. Dazzle there who's just like, I mean, bro, what do you want me to do? This is, this is uh, oh, pretty there's, good what, chance, 10 though. seconds till global? There's, there actually is a slight window here for the Dire where maybe this goes okay. Oh, the force. Oh, double call on the two. It's going to be the Morphling as well. Done. Venge, the only save that actually works this game. Gone. Stolen Shadow Wave. They'll make their way over to the Dazzle. Oh, they actually had a stun, so... Props to that, I suppose. But... Messed up his dome, so. Yeah. Rest in peace. Oh. <laughs> um. That was just. MVP having a better read of the game. I, I think they understood either what was happening or that they needed to, like, group up and popping up. You, you need it active for the second you pick it up when. Uh, <laughs> this Rubik's just gonna waveform lift you, otherwise, just like the Venge has the luxury of finding out. Carol? And this Tinker's oh, in a oh. very compromised All right. position. Dude, he is being... But then the game suddenly opens up a lot. And if they can find connections on smokes like this, which is pretty high risk, because you don't have anything instant at all. Like, if you find the life stealer, he should be able to rage a centaur stomp from a blink. Yeah. It isn't that impossible. Unless you're, like, buying in the shop or your AFK or something. That's kind of why they're pro players most of the time. Their reactions don't suck as much as mine. Uh, holding Astral mid, not really anyone else to initiate, and that's going on. Carl throws in a Marsh to kind of cover them here. Ambitious silencer play, but it's Reason who comes in now. He's going to get the grab on the Centaur. Might even get the steal here. Oh, he already used it, my mistake. He actually already stole it, so there you go. Yeah, the, uh, the counter that's stampede too was bad, there. Though. Like, one for one trade and. Uh... I uh, don't have Ember, which is like, that hero is so scary. Yeah, he's pretty safe too. Frida will get caught. Not a big deal. Again, trading one oh. hero for tower pressure. No plus two. Ping, 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 ping. Oh, yeah. PP and plus two, dude. Yeah. And you just guess wrong in the trees every time. Now they have the Tinker Ward, so it'll be a bit easier. Like, it's not so easy for them to go high ground this game. They can oh. definitely do it if, uh... Grace is actually they... crazy. Is he gonna oh. live? He just, like, walked into the centaur. He, like, knew he dude. was around there. And he He's just... buying so much space, actually. Like, they're just hitting the uh, tier 3 while uh, they're diving. 
Yeah, Rubik TP back though, and Tinker's already gone. Yeah, but that's a tiff rate. Like, yeah, no, that, that's, that's good. That's Gucci. true. Oh, nice rage too. Gets off the blind, stops the stomp from coming out there. And uh, the stolen away. stampede from the other side of the map is used here. And uh, they'll kill Avenge. Another laser though. Doctor really doesn't want to drop his Aegis for nothing. And whoop. Yes, can, they, can they force it back? Oh, he does, does he? Yeah. Oh, doesn't even use it. He goes back in trying to I disjoin it. Useful now. Oh, that was close. Oh, that was like... oh, that was pretty sick. That's the oh, real well. play, actually. That, yeah, that's. I haven't had that one happen to myself in a while, but it's always good. It does. Nice rage again here from Shuma now on top. And uh, open wounds, making sure that he has really no trouble here. That's a plus, too. Carino. Oh, oh. Nope. Uh, with the shrine there, a little bit too risky. Nope, don't care. That's just a bench using the shrine, you know? Yeah, I thought the other ones were going to come back and fight at it, but honestly, it means. Oh, oh, oh light, light. No! Can't oh, find no, the blink. He's blink. He sees him. All right, he's got him. Let's go, boys. Yeah, surprise life stealer. Oh, he can blink. Like these pings. Oh, uh, light's got blink, though. Light's got blink. Oh! oh. It's so close. It's so far. All right, space created. Tinker, he's doing work. And Morphling now has a Z blade. All right, well, well, uh, well Rubik, even Rubik though, he stole that strength, so it's like the silencer. Yeah, he, he ain't dying. He just blink dodges it. Silence is the only one. <laughs> uh oh. Oh. Oh, that's uh. That's not a solo kill I was expecting. Oh, he's a sight. He has a hex. Oh. How quick can they make it two? They kind of need to uh, oh, nice give lift. up the one set for sure. Reason's really holding out on the steel. There's nobody wants. He wants swap. Good choice. Possibly a little bit of a waste though, to be honest. I mean, that was a dead bench. Oh no, the the e blade did like 400 damage. Did he wreck that life stealer? It was close. Blink uh, infest uh... bomb od standard stuff. Yeah, I mean, he's pretty mobile, you know. Like, is he going? Uh, they can like Ferocious if they want, but yeah, there's no reason to if they feel the advantage is enough. Like, look how strong they are. Somebody's on a roll. Yeah. They feel so comfortable just doing that. There's no counterplay at all. It's so None weird to see have... a like 32 minute Morphling with nothing against Global Silence, but he's just saying that like if they have Global, we can't win a fight anyway, I guess. So I'm just going to go for items that'll win me things when there's no Global. But like none of them have ways of getting rid of global. It's actually like insane. Yeah, it's kind of I mean, weird. I mean, the support's uh, way too poor. That's not on them at all. But <laughs> oh my god, goes this blink stop. He's immediately scythe destroyed, wrecked in every fashion. Tinker to go the same fate. Carido gets hurricane right, pike. Let's go. Can He's I get a moon shard on this OD? Because that looks pretty funny. And then we'll get the axe and Doctor. Hey, he'll oh, go he down too. Well. Shuma. All right, a triple. Come back. Probably got a total of like 400 gold out of that 2,000 gold, and no, a 3,000 gold because of the buyback penalty. Oh yeah, he only. Yeah, I, I do not understand this bloodstone at all. I think he's trolling at this point. Yeah, I think he, he is the too. Game is like... Well, self lotus orb stun means there's nothing to save his friends. And uh, Dazzle also not able to save when he's silenced or when he gets an axe. So double, double issues. Yeah, no buyback. That's Tinker for a full minute gone. His ulti's going to OD. Can I just get myself a, uh, a Rubik Bloodstone? There it is, ladies and gentlemen. That's Rearm. Let's go. He needs to Rearm lift. Please, lift Rearm, lift Rearm. That's Let's a classic, actually. I, I need to see this in my life right now. Let's go. Rearm. Lift. Rearm. Rearm. <laughs> no, not Rearm. the Lotus! Rearm, race! Get him! Keep Rearm lifting! <laughs> no, stop! Oh. He needs more mana! Damn you, Risen! That would have been the crowning achievement. And to, a, to a perfect Rubik game versus Tinker and Morphling, yeah, I'd have to agree. Had all the strength, but not the adaptive strike for the ridiculous stun. Oh, well, that was some Dota. I'm just like sorry for this Dazzle. He bought 18 centuries and 14 wards. And his Venge still had less net worth than him. <laughs> oh, oh actually, hurts. let me bring up the graph for you guys.